I've been taking your courses, I think, since like April a year ago. And they've, similar to somebody else said, like everything that's been happening um, in my life correlates with what's going on. Then again, I feel like I have all the problems. So anything you could teach would <laughs> would line up. But um, I um, have been dealing with PTSD the last five years. And um, when was it? Like 2019, I went to a therapist like one-on-one -on -one. I was like I I'm having <laughs> so much trouble and like triggers and just like this hyperactive startle response I'm a physician so overhead pages the beeper going the, wait, not beepers anymore what am I talking about the phone rings whatever I'm like cursing at the phone because it rang but it scared me so badly and we went to somebody you know some professional in Denver paid a couple thousand dollars or more for the weekend, you know, and they supposedly, um, they claim they could help with this. It made me worse. Like the next day, the lady's like, I, I think I maybe like triggered you a lot yesterday. Like, how are you doing? And to me, I didn't know any better because everything was triggering me. So I'm just like, well, this is my normal life. Um, so anyway, this is the first, I mean, in five years, the first resource and understanding I've had of how to deal with a startle response and be able to start like not adding more stress every 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 time the microwave beeps. Again, or I think whatever. you know what a different paradigm when we're talking about stress. It's I think our culture is trying to minimize it trying to contain it. There's this idea of oh I feel stressed there's something wrong with me. For 52 years, I felt that being a stress bag, I called myself a stress bag, right? And, and I was always stressed trying to minimize it because I knew how dangerous it was. I'm gonna just recommend magnesium. If you're dealing with stored trauma and this going back and forth between stress and overwhelm, you need magnesium. So that's an easy place for people to start. And it also can often help bring a sense of uh, relief fast. Magnesium can really help with sleep. It's what it's most known for, at least in the people that I've shared that with. That's where they see the most difference at first is with their sleep. They sleep better. They, they're getting more restful state. Now that doesn't mean that they're all of a sudden waking up feeling fully rested, but it's just better than what it has been. It can help with anxiety. So magnesium calm is the specific form of magnesium, magnesium treonate, that is specific for the nervous system. And it will come and it will support those activated microglia, which are the cells around our neurons that cause this inflammation. And it will just calm it down. It's okay. Everything's okay. So this has been so essential that I take this and I even take a double dose. So I take one of these every day just to keep my microglia and my brain inflammation at bay. But if I notice that I'm back in those symptoms of brain inflammation, I'm taking two a day so that I can get things back, calm that fire of inflammation down and get back to a place of calm, good memory, and clear mind. So if you're finding yourself looking for words and struggling to get through your day in a calm way, then magnesium trinate is likely going to help you and be a support that you can give your brain in order to help brain inflammation. I take magnesium at midday or early afternoon because that is actually when magnesium is normally at its highest in our blood. So I'm following just the rhythm of our body. And magnesium is actually one of the most common nutrient deficiencies. And it's because it gets used up when we are stressed and definitely when our body is in the trauma response. And so this is always one of the first things that I'm starting people on when they're coming in after having been stressed for as long as they can remember. And what I do is I actually use sparkling water. So I'm gonna do about eight ounces of sparkling water. And then I add the magnesium power powder. And so for me, this is a great way to get it in is just by liquid. So I mix it up and I put it into my drink. I then stir it with a straw. 
and I enjoy feeling calm and resourced and ready to go on for the best of my day.